Hi guys, welcome back to the Nerdy Collector and I'm just popping into place in space in Croydon. Batman's watching over me there and I'm just going to pop in and see what they've got inside. I am back from Croydon. Now I know I go to Croydon a lot, 
but this week I really didn't have any um, a lot of funds to go out further so I just popped to my local shops because I was just had to do a bit of shopping so I thought I'd show you a few things I had in place in space just I know I film there lots but they have lots of good stuff and you guys like the videos so I hope you like this one as well they had a, a few new chases and things and I did pick some stuff up my um, chase collection is in the background because I've just been filming a video about that but I'm going to show you what I picked up on this hunt now I only picked up one pop and I actually got that from Forbidden Planet but I didn't record in there. It was the 8-bit Demigorgon exclusive. I've been looking for this for such a long time and when I saw it in there I couldn't believe it. I have all the others and I even had to get Lucas from America from a Target exclusive. So I'm really, really glad I picked this up. It was well worth the 14 99 I paid for it. I know it's more expensive but it is an exclusive and it will stay in the box for me. And it helps me finish my collection. They have got a Target exclusive wheel out. And um, my dad's going on holiday to America next month, so he's going to be checking targets for me for that and for the chase version of this. So that's really cool. And then some stuff that's not pops, guys. It's just stuff I picked up in that comic shop. Uh, I collect these smaller Walking Dead um, final action figures, and they had the Gareth, who I'm not really a big fan of, but they had it for five pounds. It's the only one of the only ones I don't have, so I just bought Fiverr on Nabbit just to complete the collection. Not really wanting it, but. Um, I thought to myself, if I don't get it now, I'll never get it. So for five pounds, I pick it up. And then I like the McFarlane Toys color tops, and I picked up this color top Ezekiel. I have the Negan one, which is one of my favorite characters, and Ezekiel is also one of my favorite characters. So this is going to hang on my wall, pride of place next to Negan, and um, hopefully I'll be getting a few more of these in the future. It was only sixteen pounds, so very cheap, very good from that shop. I sound like the uh, one pound fish guy. Very good, very cheap, um, and yeah, this was really good bargain and um, a great addition to my collection. So that's all I picked up guys but one thing did arrive in the post for me this week from American Amazon. Thank you to people on the uh, Marvel Legends UK page if any of you are subscribers here for dropping um, that you can order from the American Amazon and it doesn't actually add up to that much more expensive. I picked up this two pack Walmart exclusive for about £20 which is brilliant for two Marvel Legends of this Ultimate Vulture and Ultimate Spider-Man. I've had these out of box to have a look at them and they are fantastic figures. That Vulture is a, a really really good figure and so is that Spider-Man. It's a very small figure but it's a great uh, set nonetheless. I'm going to keep it in box though because it's a Walmart exclusive and it's my first one. But hopefully I'll be getting that Walmart exclusive Thanos and Black Panther. Like I said, my dad's heading to the US and then I'm gonna, he's gonna be, he's gonna be toy hunting for me guys. So hopefully he brings back some gold for me, pop wise and action figure wise. So thanks for watching this little hunt video with me guys. I know it wasn't very long, but I just thought I'd film something because I'm out and I know you guys like Place in Space by the views of the videos. So thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to hit that like button if you enjoyed this video. Drop me a comment, let me know what you think of the stuff I picked up and anything you saw in the store that you think I should have nabbed. And don't forget to subscribe. If you're already subscribed, hit the notification bell. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter and Instagram. And I'm running a, the links will be, for that will be in the description below. And I'm running a competition at the moment, guys, to give away a Chase Porg. Link is in the description below. Um, all you've got to do is subscribe to me and follow me on Twitter to enter that competition. So do that below and that will be announced on the 1st of May, the winner. So um, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.